This is Whistler Blackcomb, one of the world's most popular ski destinations. If you're planning a trip to this ski resort, in this video, we're taking you on some of our favorite beginner and intermediate runs to get you started. From the top of the Blackcomb Gondola, you can make your way across into the 7th Heaven area via Green Line. This way, you get the big mountain views without the steep and deep exit lines. This truly dreamy zone is home to more than its fair share of amazing blue runs. This is a huge sunny bowl full of intermediate cruises that looks across into Whistler. You will find some great skiing here, especially on runs like Panorama. The name really says it all with this run. Don't forget your camera and take in the fantastic views of Whistler Mountain opposite and enjoy yourself. It's the perfect place to simply let your skis carve. Beneath the 7th Heaven Chair, Upper and Lower Cloud 9 are some of the best blue runs on Blackcomb. These long cruisy slopes are great to ski or carve in the morning when the snow is freshly groomed or at the end of the day when they catch the last rays of the day. Perfect for sun seekers. These runs are a must if you're cruising a day on Blackcom. If you're wondering what's the best way to get from those blue squares to the black diamonds, then check out the blue runs on Blackcomb, as they tend to be a little steeper than those on Whistler Mountain. One of them is Slingshot and Lower Gemma. i 
Let these runs become your training ground. Once you can ride them with ease, you can gain more confidence on steep runs, which will help ease you into black diamond terrain. Let's hop over to Whistler via the peak to peak gondola. One main difference between Whistler and Blackcomb is that Whistler offers more green runs than Blackcomb. It's thus better for beginner skiers. There are lots of green runs high up the mountain and our favourite one is Burnt Stew Trail. Easy, mellow and in true alpine terrain. From the Harmony 6 Express Chair, head skiers ride into the Burnt Stew Trail. This run has got to be the most beautiful green run in the country. If you're skiing with a group of mixed levels, it's a great run that offers access to enough bowls and glaze that keep everyone interested. Jeff's Ode to Joy, which can be accessed from the Harmony Chair, is a steady, long and fun cruiser. It was a quiet day when we skied this run and it made us feel like we're carving through an alpine backcountry bowl on groomed terrain. The bottom portion of the run, which you see a bit later, branches off into a number of groomed and sodded gladed tracks through the trees. This is one of the best spots on the mountain to get comfortable with the feeling of skiing quickly between trees. The uniqueness and contrast of the upper and lower portions of this run make it a must try on the symphony chair.
Yeah, you won't get this every day. Uh, it's all downhill from here. Yeah. Oh, this is pretty cool. You can go all the way down. Okay. Right, Trace, go.